Happy Thursday. Today is November 18th, and welcome to this episode of the Sycamore Junior High Daily Announcements. I'm Evan. And I'm Lily. And if you would now please join us as we stand, face the flag, place our hand over our heart, and honor our country while we say the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you for joining us, and you may be seated. It is exactly one week for Thanksgiving, yay. Also, tomorrow is Friday, and we only have two days of school next week. I can't believe how fast the year is going by. Next thing we know it is winter break. I know, I can't believe it's nearly already the end of November. Next up, we have yesterday's survey results. It was a survey asking if you prefer about your preferred superpower. Here are the results. Yesterday's riddle was Mississippi has four S's and four I's. How can you spell that without the S's or the I's? And the answer is T-H-A-T. The last sentence said, how can you spell that without I's and S's? And the riddle for today is, a man calls his dog from the opposite side of the river. The dog crosses the river without getting wet, without using a bridge or a boat. How? This answer will be given during tomorrow's announcements. Now we have our fact of the day. Did you know that today is Mickey Mouse's birthday? Really? Happy birthday, Mickey. Well, now let's see who shares a birthday with Mickey Mouse. A very special birthday shout out to a staff member, Mr. Heffron, and students Rylan J and Azarat U. We hope you have an amazing birthday. Our reliable and passionate Mr. Harris will sadly not be able to join us today, so Anna will take over. Hi guys, it's Anna, and I will be filling in for Mr. Harris today. First up, 8th graders, please check your email for an email from the Sycamore High School regarding this innovation lab, as well as all students need to check their email for attendance alert as in an early dismissal and non-sports related items that have been dropped off to them on the table in the main lobby. It is the responsible young adult thing to do to be informed. Friday, the first class store will be in the cafeteria. Bring your first class tickets to the first class store to exchange them for some cool prizes. We will try to keep you guys updated about where that will be. The International Club will meet this Friday after school in the Media Center. Do you wish you had time during the day to work on your passions, almost like a Google Genius Hour? Did you enjoy the PBL wings at the Green School? Then the Cinevation Lab may be the place for you. Go to at Cinevation Lab on Twitter or read the s'more information on applying and a chance to visit. Student Council has created a survey that they would love for you to fill out. It is regarding creating a study all day during flex time. What's your opinion? Check your email for the survey or go to the SJH News Crew Communications One Stop Opinion Shop. Code OZUJS35 right here to voice your opinion on your flex time. Have a good day! Now we have the result of the joke and short story contest. Hello, everybody. I'm here to announce the winner of the short story contest. The winner is Sana. Here you go, Sana. Thank so, you. so, can you tell us um, what's your story about? Uh, my story is about a girl that's dreaming about being chased by lots of people, um, but she realizes the people were never there, but she just understood that the beauty of nature was always there. Very cool. And what's the title of your story? I forgot. You forgot. <laughs> okay, well, um, if you would like to see Sana's story, please check out the Google Classroom with the code OZUJS35. Also, thank you to our runner-up, Josiah M. Congratulations, Sana. And now we have our joke contest winner. Congratulations to Maeve B. Thank you. Her joke will be posted on Google Classroom, so make sure to check it out. Also, congratulations to our runners-up, Jacob G. and Audrey B. Your jokes were great. Have a good day. That is all we have for today. Don't forget to check the SJH Communications Classroom for today's daily survey and check those emails. Have a great day. Since the joke contest winner has been announced, we'll continue to use joke submissions. But today's joke is our winner, Maeve B. A guy and a girl are getting ready for prom. The guy walks into a tux shop, but the line was so long. He waits in the line and finally gets his tux. After that, he goes to a flower shop to get flowers, but the line was also really long. So he waits and gets his flowers. When the girl and the guy get to prom, the line to get in is long as well. The guy's pretty fed up with the line, but he still waits in it. When they get in, the guy goes to get punch. But lucky him, there was no punch line. <laughs> Go Aves!